Hey, what's up everybody? It's the Hyphenate here, and today I'm gonna show you guys how to easily import and export your custom key commands in DaVinci Resolve. So if you've already gone to your keyboard customization, made whatever changes you want it, programmed your keys for specific functions, then you've probably already saved a profile. And the export process is really simple. Now, if you haven't yet, but you plan to, to get into the keyboard customization, you just go to the top left, click on DaVinci Resolve, scroll down, you'll see keyboard customization. Go ahead and click on that. Make whatever custom key commands you want. Click on the top right options and you can press save as new preset. Name it whatever you want and then your preset will be here. So I have one already called Majestic. If I click on the little arrow here, I get a drop down menu with all the different profiles I have, including any custom ones that you've saved. To export your custom key commands profile, click on the top right options and click export preset. And then here, choose the one that you want. For me, I'm gonna choose Majestic. Choose the location that you wanna save it in. I recommend leaving your file name the same, though you don't have to. And then go ahead and click save. Now I put it in this flash drive, I already opened it up, so you can see here that it is a TXT file. I'm gonna go ahead and eject this flash drive. And then now to import it, we're gonna go to my other computer. You're gonna to wanna to go ahead and copy your profile from your flash drive to anywhere on your computer, just know where it's at. All right, so here I am in DaVinci Resolve on my other computer. I'm gonna go ahead and go to DaVinci Resolve on the top left, keyboard customization. And now that this is open, click on the options on the top right corner, go to import preset, locate the file and go ahead and select that. And that's it, that's how simple it is. So if you click on any key command that you've customized, for me, I changed my comma to timeline start. And so here I can see it instantly reflects the moment I imported the profile. Now keep in mind, if you are using multiple computers and you go and customize the keyboard further by adding new key commands to the same profile, it's not gonna transfer over to your other computer. So then you're gonna need to export from whatever has the newest updates or the newest commands, and then go ahead and paste it on the other computers and overwrite, or you can save them as a new profile name. So there you guys have it, that's how simple it is. Hopefully this helped you guys out. If you did, please drop a like on this video, drop a comment below if you have any questions, and please make sure to subscribe. I have a lot more videos coming soon. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.